Hello guys, good morning. Um, it's Henry here with another awesome tutorial for you guys. So um, today we are going to take our first look at Figma. Figma.com um, it's a design tool that we will use um, for the assignment we have to do today. So it's a pretty cool design tool. It's a modern design tool. Um, it's definitely unlike what you guys expect, like Photoshop or CorelDRAW, or, you know, the ch traditional tools. Um, we, will, we wouldn't really look at those tools. You know, we're going to jump straight into Figma. So you guys should just create an account if you don't already have one. Um, I already have an account, so I'm just going to sign up to my account. And this is for the task we're doing today, but I'll just give you guys like an overview of Figma. Um, so I have to, I made the account with my Gmail, so let me just use that sign in. It's pretty easy to create your account. So yeah, I'm into my account right now. You can see I have a lot of screens I've designed for. But we don't look at that. We're going to just come over here and create a new file. So um, this video, you know, aims to help explain just the, the beginning things you need to know about Figma. So when you click on a new file, it loads up like this. You know, you get this blank screen. Um, so you know, some of you may be confused as to what to do next. So I'm just going to go over some basics. Um, you guys will still receive a link for a Figma course that you would have to still do um but what i'm about to just share is just to show you guys like the basics of what it's supposed to do so if you can follow my mouse i'm going to the left corner so you can see your tools your move to your skill tool that's all um you can see you have a frame tool and slice tool Right, you can see your shapes, your square, line, arrow, ellipse to star and image. You can place an image. You can see your pencil, classic pencil to classic as well, type tool and comment. That's basically it for the tools you have access to. For those of you that use Facebook, the first thing you may be turn. For those of you that use Photoshop, sorry, Photoshop, shout out Photoshop, the first thing you realize is that these guys don't have much um, tools. So I want you guys to get used to not depending on tools because design is not about your tools. Um, but for this, each thing you want to create will have to be inside a frame. A frame is basically like an artboard. What an artboard is in um, Illustrator. Um, so when you click on the frame, you see these guys open up to the right. You can check if you want from a phone, iPhone X, S8, Google Pixel 2, Pixel XL, an Android phone. You can see if you check one for, for a tablet, an iPad mini. You can see the one you want for desktop, MacBook, MacBook Pro and all that you can even see like papers like a4 a5 a6 then for those of you that want to create posts for social you see all of them here instagram story you know instagram post everything is over here so for this um what we're basically going to do is we're going to create a desktop view so you can see we have a desktop view over here. So 
um i'm not really going to go into much details right but what we'll do right now is a very simple um ui that should help you guys um you know get familiar um, with the tools so when you click on your shape tool i'm going to click a rectangle and just draw <coughs> one across like this um sorry it's not it's not in the frame so let me just put it back let me put it in the frame now and put it inside the frame now we can now it's in the frame okay um so i'm not i'm not actually going to design a website i'll just do more of a wireframe so like let's assume this is like the menu bar you know um i'm i'm going to hold this and drag it while holding alt to duplicate it so i just duplicated that so let's just put this over here so let's say this is the hero image i'm going to come down here to the fill and i would make this a little bit lighter so let's just say this is the hero image of this of this site you know it's like a really big site this is hero image saying welcome to our site with like a really nice person's face there i'm going to come back to this rect rectangle tool you know and draw some more so let's assume this is a really cool copy 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 um if, i'm sure a lot, of, a lot of what i'm doing may be really conf confusing to like all of you guys but if you yeah. can listen and try and follow along it, sh it shouldn't be that hard so let's just say this is a really cool copy right then we're taking the same tool then let's just say this right here is a really cool image so this is a really cool image over here let's put it like this you know okay you can see it's, it's kind of starting to look like a website then the last but not this is a call to action button down here so this is the button they want us to click um, let me make it a little bit darker like this and yeah we have our first mock-up ui so just so i can know that you guys were able to watch this video um i'll give you guys the um exercise to try and replicate this ui um i'll share the link to this as well but for the task you're supposed to do today it has nothing to do with this you're supposed to go on the internet look for websites that you feel you like the way they look and take screenshots of of those um sites and in and in put those shots into figma so there are many ways for you to to do this you have to pick four sites two that you like the design and two that you don't like the design um so you are to have them side by side like this don't mind that you may not understand what i'm doing now but you have to have so when you take a a screenshot of the websites right just paste it into figma like copy it and like and like just paste it into here then let's assume this is a screenshot that you took under it you just state why you like it why why do you like the design for that for the one that you like you state i like these designs because of this i like these designs because of this then the ones that you 
do not like you also state why you don't like it so this exercise is to help you guys understand how to see design so I hope this video was really helpful um, hope you guys have an awesome day and uh, yeah I'll see you guys in the chats peace